Stefan, more now on a story we told you about this morning on WIAT.com. Alabama is dealing with a fallout from the arrest of a star football player on charges of possessing a weapon without a permit. Now we are learning more about what led to that arrest. CBS 42 Sports Director Chris Brees in studio with us tonight with the details on what happened with linebacker Tim Williams. Chris? Yeah, like Sherry said, carrying a gun without a proper permit. 2 a.m. this morning when Williams was in his car at a public parking lot with a friend, a police officer smelled marijuana coming from the car. The friend said that was his. And when the officer searched the car, he found a Glock 41 handgun. Williams said he bought it in Louisiana three weeks ago and was given a temporary paper permit for it, but did not have that with him. Williams gave the officer a receipt for the gun, thinking that would qualify as a permit. The officer said, no, it does not. It's not a valid permit, pistol permit. He was then taken to jail and released on $300 bond. Saban, the coach, said this shortly afterwards. This kind of behavior is not condoned in our program. We're currently in the process of reviewing all the information. Once we have a complete understanding of the situation, we will determine what we need to do in terms of an appropriate discipline. So what could happen to Tim Williams in terms of punishment? You can look at what happened the last couple of months for other guys. We'll talk about that coming up in sports.